Hi, welcome to today's Talk of the Town. I'm Sandy Benson. Since 1961, the Women's Association of Hilton Head Island, WAHI, has played a vital role in the community. They are currently 500 strong and here to talk about the goals and the mission of this nonprofit women's organ organization, Sue Todd, President, and Kathy Reynolds, President-elect. Welcome, ladies, to the show. Thank, Thank you, you for having us. So let's talk a little bit about WAHI. What is it? Well, it is a very large women's group, nonprofit. It's, it encompasses Hilton Head Island and Bluffton, okay. out to um, Island West. It's a group of women who who try to come get come together. I'm sorry, come together. Uh, we have different interest groups, which Kathy will be happy to explain, and we uh, also have four luncheons a year, where the entire membership gets together, and we have speakers at each luncheon. Our next, excuse me, our next luncheon is September 28th. Upcoming. Yes, and we have uh, Kelly Paul coming, who is an author of True and Constant Friends. And it's, a, it's just, she'll be very good. It's, it's about the inspiration she has. Uh, I'm sorry, it's about the inspiration she has uh, from her friends in college. Okay. And it's, it's just a very enlightening book for women. Wonderful. And so um, you said that there's um, groups within the group, different interest groups within the group. So Kathy, Absolutely. I'll, I'll, I'll let you um, um, speak on that. Absolutely. Um, the organization is a great way for women to meet other women outside their own specific neighborhood. And we have over 40 interest groups ranging from art classes to writing groups and everything in between. So if you're interested in learning how to cook or learning how to use your computer easier, uh, if you're interested in taking a nature walk, then we have a group that would be of interest to you. Oh, that's great. So um, how do you join? You can join on our website, which is www.wahi.com. Uh, there's an, a membership form there. We have, uh, I believe, did you get the phone number for we the have our member? We'll have everything on the screen. Flashing. Okay, that's our <laughs> membership chairman. Okay. And uh, sh you can join through that. And so how do members contact, um, make contact with each other then? Well, through the interest groups okay. and through the luncheons. And each interest group, some of them may meet only once a month and some may meet more, more regularly. And those are the smaller groups. And they all, they get together whenever the uh, group decides they want to do that. So that's it all kind of determined within the group itself, Correct. the smaller group itself. Yes, yes. And so how does WAHI reach out to the community? Well, we reach out in many ways. We've done um, many, many things. One of our best things is uh, a, a new interest group, a newer interest group, called Difference Makers. And they do a monthly one-day project okay. for the community. We've restocked Deep Well. We have done beach sweeps. And at the beach sweeps, we will have a, a nature uh, lover mm -hmm. who, who will explain to us all the little invisible things that are on the beach. We have done um, <coughs> a, a number of things for the Children's Center. We collect coats for them, and we, we make uh, we design Christmas gifts and uh, at the Christmas luncheon, which is in December. Okay. And then we deliver them to the Children's Center. Nice. And so uh, what are some of the, um, like, what's the age group of uh, WAHI for, for women? Is there an age group? Not really. I, I think we're probably anything over 40. Okay. <laughs> probably okay. leaning toward the 60s, 50s, 60s. Okay. Yeah. So, so it can be individuals that are working because it sounds like the schedule is, is not too difficult to meet. Yes. Um, or it could be people that are retired or just, you know, looking for something to do extracurricular or volunteer? Yes, it's a way for women to connect with other women yeah. and to gather and to share knowledge and share their ideas and learn new things because our interest groups are also very educational. And quickly, what are some visual ways that WAHI has contributed to the community? Uh, the tales of Hilton Head Island, which is on, uh, it's the statue that Walter Palmer, Palmer did and it's on at, Hilton, or at Honeyhorn. Oh, okay, Great. And we've restored the hack house at Honeyhorn. Uh -huh. We have uh, done the pathway kiosks. We, we helped with that. We've done a corral at the library. Yeah. And we've just donated like quite to, a few things. We've donated to many different right. organizations too, depending on how much money we have at the end of the year. And 
your group is open, so people need to, women need to um, um, connect. Find, connect, exactly. Yes. Well, thank yes. you for joining us today. Thank you. Thank you very much. And we'll be right back with Talk of the Town.